if anyone's wondering why people get paid for Instagrams, <laughs> because this is the reality. It just takes time figuring out the lighting and like the setup and like, you know, even though this looks messy now, um, it's all going to be photoshopable, all the cracks, any dark areas, but uh, it's kind of a lot of shoot styling, I suppose. Congratulations, you've made it to day 21 of the vlog. I may look like I have my shit together, but the truth is I don't. It's 4 p.m. I've literally been absent from the vlog all day, all day. Feeling the pressure a little bit more today. I woke up an hour late and yesterday's vlog was particularly lengthy to edit for some reason, even though it may not seem it. There was just lots of different clips and it just didn't feel very coherent for me. It wasn't the easiest vlog out of all vlogs to edit, but we got there. I think it's just about ready to upload. So sorry about that if it's a little bit late. I'm heading off on a little bit of a photo shoot with um, an Irish photographer who shoots on film and I don't always reply to those type of emails but she seemed really nice and I really liked her style and um, so we're just gonna go out and have a bit of an experimentational shoot in a roof it shouldn't be too complicated a little bit of crack you know yourself but first I gotta hit that social media life and get my Instagram slot in I'm gonna edit that little photo that me and Kyle took with the big messy setup here earlier and get that posted before I leave Done. Backpack on. We are on the move. I'm definitely going to be at least five minutes late. What's new there? I hate these days though where I feel like my day is only starting even though I've been working all day. It's one of those double time days where I work from the moment I wake up till when I have probably my dinner really late at like nine or ten. Um, but it just means that other days I'm more free to just enjoy myself and enjoy being in New York. So I'm not complaining. It's a schedule that I like but it just means that when you do work you work really hard. This is Kelsey, I leave her. I'm guessing you have Instagram, I right? Do, yeah. So she, you mostly shoot on like medium format or just film in general. So yeah, we've gone onto this gorgeous rooftop. It's the most amazing view of New York here. Your friend is so lucky. Absolutely, it's stunning up here. Kelsey's class gear. We've got a box full of film. <laughs> And idiot here forgot my tripod. Kelsey asked me for my tripod and I was like, yeah, no problem. And what did I leave the house without? The tripod. So Kaha's running all the way down here and we're not too far away. So we should be here in like 10, 15 minutes and hopefully we'll catch the light for some shots. Kaha came to the rescue, night in shining armor. <laughs> you look like a cyborg with your headphones like that. Sunset is insane. Finally got sorted. This is the medium format camera we're going to be shooting on. I've always wanted to have pictures on one of these, so excited to see the results. It is killer. Look at how this looks, guys. That is so cool. a video once I get home but it's it's evenings like this where it's very hard not to eat out such a nice such a nice evening okay so we are going to eat at home and be good but I've barely eaten all day and I still need to keep my energy up so we're going for sugar a sugar rush and um, we're gonna share an ice cream I've been meaning to take off to treat house in the Upper East Side for a really long time 
they do the most like unique ice cream sandwich ice pop things ever and we're just gonna share one because they're they're pretty small we made it to treat house straight to the good stuff at the back where there is oh so good so they've got cookies and cream cookie dough bake sale original and coffee and cream all right let's go let's do it this is funny i'm gonna photoshop that on your next birthday card it's a nice shot show it off so what we have here is the ice cream layer two layers of cookie dough on each side all in dark chocolate mm. Definitely, if you're in the Upper East Side, you have to try one. Well, my grocery shop has made such an effort. Back to my old habits, my draft latte coffee. So we're taking the fast route out tonight. I'm trying this ramen, which I feel like I've seen on so many like, YouTube challenges, but it's the gourmet spicy Shin Ramyun noodle soup. So gonna give it a go. I'm starving so I don't even feel bad about having this. Bit of a veggie dinner tonight. I'm a fan of the stir fries at the moment so just I've got those noodles I showed you, broccoli all in there, some spinach and a fried egg on top. As you guys know that is like my five to ten minute go-to dinner when I don't want to think that's what I make. It's not the healthiest but it's not the worst either. I need to gobble this down. I'm so hungry. Uh, and once Kyle's done cooking his, I'm gonna put the backdrop back down and hopefully have a successful, short, quick and easy filming session. I'm gonna try and do like a mini haul. Um, I've got a couple of nice pieces that I wanna share and it'll sort of be part of Vlogtober. Um, so yeah, hopefully I get that done tonight. It'll really lighten the load for tomorrow. Half nine now, hopefully I'll be done filming by like 10. We're gonna, re we're gonna remain optimistic. Everything is on the floor per usual, but yay. The haul has been filmed and I don't think we're too far off schedule. 10.30, not too bad, not too bad. I mean, this was supposed to be all done by like 6 p.m. But hey ho, we got it done. This one less video I need to worry about. Oh, starting to get shiny, but this held up well. This is the uh, NARS Matte Lip Crayon. I haven't used this in a while. I remember I got like a set of four of these a while back. This is the shade Cruella. Mm, yeah, I definitely think it's like a nice deep, Cruella red with a little bit of blue in there and um, so I like it it's like a I don't always feel like the bright red so this one's quite it's a nice one I like it very easy to apply so yeah I'm going to bed like I should be which is knackered and fulfilled feeling and productive feeling as well so I hope you all enjoyed today's short but sweet vlog if you're new to the channel and like what you've seen so far or you just watch me like through Instagram or whatever. I really, really appreciate it if you took the time to sign into your YouTube or even create a YouTube account and subscribe to my channel. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Mwah.